it was it was. Jay come back to the hospital. I know he did. Yeah, yeah. They came during the week, a couple of the days later and shit and all. Okay, that. he come out, but you get out two weeks later. Did he hustle while you? Oh, in, or did he put the door? Nah, when I got out. Nah, nah. I ain't gonna lie. When I got up, Jay was all the way up. I had to hustle my back to the wall, ashy knuckles, pockets filled with a lot of lint, not a cent. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Oh, so that's the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I'm like, how my mom get this quick? Then when they throw this shit on you, then you, as you going out, that white light. You know what I mean? It's a white light that you attracted to. Yeah. And you keep, you going in this white light. Like, what the, what the, and then my grandma's pop up. Like, nah, 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 nah. It's like, wake up, boy, wake up. <laughs> wake up, boy. Yeah. You're like, huh? You know what I mean? <laughs> you better die. <laughs> oh, you better go. Yeah, but that gun flash though, it's something about that. When homie hit me, that, that flash though, you see your whole life in, in a flash. Yeah. It's that it's real. No, no, no. I get it. You see every thing in a flash. Your good this, that, your baby being born, this, that, all of this. Like the yeah, it's just like a mo that is the, the movies had to get it. They had to get it. From yeah, they had to get it from it's somebody. Be, cause it's a real thing. Yeah. Like, so all I can remember is that you know, after that, I know. You know, I stayed in the hospital about two weeks. I was supposed to stay the week. Um, there was so many girls up there fighting, son. Yo, that's another thing about man this <laughs> going to hospital. Something happened. Anybody coming to the hospital oh, at the yeah, same time? Yeah. So yeah, all, all of them, all of them. What you going through? Uh, you know, mama love in the hallway, like, listen, 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 listen. And she only know the one person going in there. Only one be you going in there. But other than that, man, it was, it was. Did Jay come back to the hospital? I know he did. Yeah, yeah, they came during the week, a couple of the days later and shit and all that. Okay, he come to hospital, but you get out two weeks later. Did he hustle while you oh. in, or did he put the door? Nah, when I got out, nah, nah, I ain't gonna lie, when I got up, Jay was all the way up. I had to hustle my back to the wall, ashy knuckles, pockets filled with a lot of land, not a cent. Jim is mean all the way up. Uh, that nigga ran shit like an enterprise. He, he had it going. He had it going. He had it going. He had he he had it all the way up. Yeah, he had it all the way up. Yeah, he had it all the way up. But it was it was the team I left. Okay, but but it's it was Jay. It was. It. I hate to just be like Jay, but it was, I had our own Rock Boys. Rock Boy in the building. You already know. Rock Boys in the building. It was Jay, Panama, and my Uncle Buzz. You could not separate. That operation would never work without this. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, but Jay ran shit next in line I, when I went down. Yeah, he still on business. He had a different way of hustling. What was different about the way he ran an enterprise? He, he, he liked workers. He he loved he he had workers. When I came back, it was like uh like he had a whole crew of workers and 10, 10, 12, 15 guys working. Me, I was going out there getting it. But that's what I'm saying. Like he did it like that. Do you think that's a reflection of the way he ran with Damon Big when he went into that operation? Or was he even was 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 his with him doing that with Damon Big, you know, excluding you because that at that time and then we skipped a little bit but mm -hmm. we we'll go back. Do you feel like his impact is very powerful then, or was it day running through these Zek rooms and everything like like the perception is out there? Um, what do you think? Yo, I, I could truly say that I can't tell. I don't no, know. No, I'm just saying, did you with you seeing who Holly is as a person right now? This is simply you just you know look. So, you gotta look at it. Look at the fact that Jay blew up to billions now. Cool. Right. So without a lot of the people that was around him at first, so he's holding his own. Mm -hmm. What was it about him that stuck out to make him beat the J Hills right now? And I know you go down, don't go dark. Don't don't go dark. I don't. It might be the Sagittarius or something. Yeah. I don't know, bro. And maybe them day ways. But you but you didn't it's not the everything that he's doing now I never seen in him. So I don't that's not the same J. So did he evolve to this day? So you say during that time he was more of a just you know uh, he's saying he's shouting shoot. Well, you heard what he yeah. said to you every first you hear it. Yeah. So what I'm saying is, I'm just saying like was was he the type of guy then that you could see evolving into what he is now? 
that billionaire and that person that everybody looks at that, you know, he's a very, he do big deals. He done did some huge deals on his own. Yeah. You know why I could see him evolving to where he at now? Because when I look at the people he's been around ever since, from Jazzo teaching him the business and understanding the business and how shit works in the industry and how they treat you on the industry, from Kane taking him on tour and understanding how it is to work a tour and do the crowd and do all that. So yeah, while him, those lessons learned, yeah, I can see that where, where he at right now. And the re reason I say that is because because you would have seen some similarity, something that, because you say he had it going when we got out. That's what, yeah. So he really, like, I connect dots. Like, I've been a hustler for a long time. Mm -hmm. So that same mentality follows you. That's why when I, when I got ready to interview you, my thing was, the eight, if you didn't touch this kind of money, your mind state. Still on that kind of money. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You can't just get out of that. You know, yeah. just, that's what I tell people. That's a big addic don't that's a fall. bigger addiction, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's a big addiction. And so where your mind state is or where you'll be, right? Mm -hmm. So that's why I was asking you, like, like when you see him now and just seeing how he bought because he couldn't go back either. Once once Jay hit that level, that's where he at. Same thing with you. Okay. You doing things now to try to basically you you have you forgiven Jay Z? Let me ask you that one. Hell yeah. You forgave me? That's how I got peace. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, nah, bro, nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> Yo, bro, honestly, though, I love, uh, I, I gotta love my brother because that's not the same Jay I know, first of all. So, anyway, at the end of the day, yeah, I had to forgive all of them, not just Jay. I had to forgive all of them for what they done because that shit held me kept. That shit, that shit held me captive. You feel? For a long time, man, to where, you know, it took me in a dark place. That's what I'm saying. You know what I mean? That's why when you say you go, you go back to the YouTube and, and that era of that, where I, so what you saw was, you know, I was going through a stage of what I call it. It was it was rage. It was anger. It was it was madness. And it all all those ingredients in the pot stirred up to be hate. And, and that hate took me to a dark spot. That shit took me all the way to, you know what? I tell you this, and this is this is in the book, and, and, and this is one of the key parts of the book. But that hate took me to homeless. Wow. A lot of people wouldn't know that. That hate went homeless. That hate took me to homeless, my nigga. And when you went homeless, you That's rock bottom. But did you want help? I got, I got relatives, I got people that's in the streets right now. Ah, uh, they don't mentally. They don't want to even be around people. You don't want. Yeah, well, you don't want to be around people. Nah, you don't want to be around people, and people not even looking at you uh, that way. It's almost like they kind of feel sorry for you. It's a bad place, bro. <laughs> you understand? Homeless, and to where you know, um, had to wake up and say, "Yo, well, you know, well, what got me out of?" that federal situation what how why would i get out of this federal situation and, and end up here how does that happen and who got me out of the federal situation so i ended up back on my knees in church and on my knees going to the one that didn't let me down because when i was in that when i was in jail when i was in that prison and then I was like, Joe, when is Jay coming to get me? Yo, he's supposed to come and get me, come and check on me. Jay, Jay, Jay. Yeah. And I was depending on and focusing on the wrong person. They had me tricked like that's God. Well, let me let you see until you're right because. Well, that's name. You understand? They had me in the illusion like this nigga can solve my problems <laughs> because of his financial status and who he is. Yeah. This nigga, but nah, they, 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 I'm steady waiting because he said, yo, don't worry, I got you. Yeah, yeah. That, that part. Up until I'm like in my old lawyer office looking through my old paperwork going, man, listen. What? What? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.